It's time to open another pack of UFC trading cards. I have one, two, three, four, five left. Let's go with Nimo. This one. All right. Pardon me while I pop the seal on this bad boy. Let's see what we got inside. And we're going to start with, well, that's a very good start to a pack of cards. Frankie Edgar. No longer a lightweight, but I am very happy with that. That is a great way to start a pack of trading cards. And not bad a follow-up. Junior Dos Santos. Two for two on this pack of UFC top trading cards. What's number three? Philippe Nover. Um, I already have one of his cards, so I'm not going to get super excited about that. Although, it's one of those fooled you it's not an autograph or a trading card double thick card. So, maybe you could call it a variant, but either way, Philippe Nover. Next up... Frankie Edgar and Sean Shirk. Edgar... By a unanimous decision. Okay. After that, a debut card. It's Steve Steinweiss versus Ryan Jensen. Why do I not remember Steve Steinweiss at all? Was this guy a prospect? Uh, Ryan Jensen is the bigger star of the two of them on this card to me, and not just because I'm from Omaha and he's from Omaha, but I don't think anybody knows who Steve Steinweiss is. Sorry. Speaking of fighters that are better known than their opponents, Aaron Riley, A-Train, whoever he's fighting on this card, well, whatever. Well, this pack started out well, and it's going downhill now. Thomas Dwall. Can't really get excited about that. Oh, the last one's a decent card. Steve Cantwell. I like him. So there you go. Not as good as the last pack with the Brock Lesnar and the autograph Clay Guida, but what are you going to do? Can't win them all.